Hello my hotties and thotties. Today I am doing a lookbook and I'm showing you guys some of my favorite pastel winter outfits that I've been wearing throughout this season. Right now I've been really obsessed with monochrome and also bejeweled accessories. And so those are the reoccurring themes that you'll be seeing in a lot of the outfits in this video. So for my first outfit, this is a lilac and white combination outfit. For my top, I'm wearing one of my favorite pieces. This is from For Love and Lemons. This was actually classified as a lingerie piece, but I love buying lingerie pieces, especially different types of bustiers. I'm pairing off this top with a long silky skirt with a lace trim. I think the fabric and also the lace trim of this skirt plays really well with the idea that you could take something like lingerie and take something like this skirt that looks and feels like a slip, but you can dress it up so that it can be a part of your everyday wardrobe. The shoes that I chose to pair this look with are these gorgeous, strappy, bejeweled high heels from Renee Calvilla. These are just the most stunning shoes in the world and they capture the light so beautifully. Because it's still winter time and it's a little bit chilly in LA, I'm throwing on one of my favorite winter pieces. And this is just a fluffy cropped cardigan from YesStyle with bejeweled buttons. I've been wearing this non-stop this entire season and it's definitely one of my favorite closet essentials. For my accessories, I'm wearing my Lumine charm from my limited edition jewelry collection with Keston. And I love how the silver sparkles so perfectly with my nails. I accessorize with a lot of hairpins layered on top of each other for a very dramatic effect. Our next outfit is super sweet with these pastel pink tones and the Parisian inspired silhouette. For my top, I'm wearing two layers. On the outside, I'm wearing this pink cardigan from Miu Miu, and it also has a crochet collar detail. On the inside, I'm wearing a white blouse with a Peter Pan collar, which is the one that you see peeking out. When I was purchasing some of my first designer clothing pieces, I wanted something that was going to be versatile for me because I knew that I would be able to layer this Peter Pan blouse under a ton of different looks. To complete this look, I'm wearing one of my favorite white skirts. This is a flared high-waisted skirt from Jing, and ignore the fact that it's super wrinkly. Like, all of my clothes in this video are wrinkly. I like don't iron my clothes, but I should definitely do that. For accessories, I'm pairing my pink cardigan with this pink beret from Miss Style, which turns out to be the perfect color match. And then for jewelry, I'm wearing this amazing and gorgeous piece from Miu Miu. For my shoes, I'm wearing these adorable pearl and bow detailed high heels. These are from Public Desire, and I know that this design is originally from this shoe brand called Mock and Mock, but they keep selling out and they're never in stock in my size, but I'm always on the hunt, so one day I will get my hands on the original version. To tie in the look all together and to make this look more comfortable and casual and a little bit more warm too, I wore some pink socks underneath. My next outfit is something very dolly. For my dress, I'm wearing this amazing one piece with a box pleated skirt, velvet pink bows, a faux fur trim, and also these delicate pearl detailed straps. There's so much going on with this dress. It's such a unique piece and I actually found it randomly through this one like Instagram store called Dollette and it's definitely pretty warm. So it's actually really great for a winter piece. For my accessories lately, I've been so obsessed with opera length gloves and these are just a random pair that I bought off Amazon. And although I love the look and the silhouette, I really don't like the shininess of it. And so I'm definitely keeping my eye out for a pair of gloves that I actually do like. To match the pearl detailing of the straps, I went over the top and I paired it off with my pearl choker from Vivian Westwood. And then on my legs, I'm wearing these super cute stockings with a cutout and bow detail. I'm wearing my new baby angel Louis Vuitton bag. I really, really love the soft pink color on this one. And I also love the heavy gold detailing, which kind of toughens it up a little bit. This may sound surprising to you given how I dress. A lot of the times I have to convince myself that it's okay to look over the top. Sometimes I do walk out of my house feeling super silly, but with outfits like these, I'm trying to remind myself that you don't need a reason to dress up as long as it's for yourself and as long as it makes you happy. And so this is definitely one of my more extravagant outfits, but it does make me really happy to wear it. For my next outfit, I have another Parisian inspired silhouette. I have just been really obsessed with Parisian style clothing recently. And so this is my take on it. I went pretty deep into a lilac phase recently. And so if you couldn't tell already, my favorite colors are currently pink and lilac. And so I really love this outfit because it combines all of my current favorite colors. So this set is actually from YesStyle. I love nothing more than a matching three piece set. And this is my favorite that I have in my closet 
right now. I got really into wearing rings for the first time ever, and so on my fingers, I have my custom-made ring from Soulbound Jewelry, which is an amazing indie shop. And the other two rings I'm wearing, I am so sorry, I actually bought these at a random boutique in New York, and I can't remember where I bought them from, so if anybody recognizes them, please drop a comment below and thank you so much. And I'm wearing my new Baby Angel Louis Vuitton bag, and to match it off, I am also wearing my new Baby Pink shades, again, from Louis Vuitton. I was never really an LV girl, but recently they've just been releasing these super adorable baby pink pieces and I've just been collecting them like mad and they just work so well in my closet. I'm wearing my Gucci tights to keep warm and I'm wearing my favorite shoes from Notaletto. I've been dying to have these for so long. These are just my perfect dream shoe. I mean, the silhouette is so unique and the color is so adorable and it just matches so well with all of my favorite colors right now. All right, for our last outfit, this is my fluffy winter angel look and despite how it looks, is actually really warm. So of course, I think many of you recognize the iconic pink puff dress from Selkie. I have this dress in like seven different colors. I'm not even lying. It's just the most adorable dress ever. And I found out that a really great way to transition this dress into the winter time is to throw a turtleneck underneath. And so I'm wearing my favorite turtleneck from Aritzia. It's definitely one of my favorite winter essentials. And it definitely keeps me really warm when worn as a layer underneath clothes. Again, no outfit of mine is complete without jewelry, and so I'm wearing the same rings as before, and I'm pairing it off with my Darla necklace from my Secret Garden jewelry collection with Keston. If you guys were wondering who does my nails, I have an amazing nail artist in K-Town in LA, and I will leave her information down below. Lastly, to finish off this look, I'm pairing this outfit with these ridiculous, super high patent baby pink boots. So that's it for this video. I love creating lookbooks, and I don't often get to do them, but I'm definitely trying to do that more this year. If there's any type of lookbook that you would love to see from me, please let me know. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys again next week. Bye.